this is perfection. Hey. Hi, welcome once again to The V. Um, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Padman Senati Raja. I'm a V partner and the executive director of The V. And I'm putting together for the next one hour, all right, a training module on video for you. If you're watching this at home, this would apply to you if you've already started in the business and you're starting to grow in the business. All right, the next one hour is going to be the most important one hour of your networking career with Questnet and the V. Now, I've been in the business for nine years and I've been building it all over the world. And one thing I realize is that everyone gets started very easily in this business. You sign up, you buy a product, buy this cheap pendant, a beautiful watch, whatever you purchase, and you get into the business. Now, a lot of people feel that that step of signing up is the end of it. It is not. It's just the beginning. All right? And if you know me well enough, I always tell people when I travel around the world doing training, is that the easiest thing you will ever do in QuestNet is sign somebody up. Convince somebody to purchase a product and be part of the system. Now, I know it sounds like, oh, it's easy for you to say, Patman, you're already successful. No, even from the early days. Signing up somebody is a matter of how convincing you are, all right, how big your dream is, how serious you are about the business, and you sign somebody up. Now, the journey of that person has been the biggest mystery in our industry. That means from the time you sign up, all right, till the time you achieve your dreams of financial freedom, that journey is the most difficult journey you'll ever have if you're not part of a proper system. So today's topic of this video all right, is basically about the concept of network marketing and the need for there to be a system and more importantly the need for you to be plugged into a system. Now a lot of people take this for granted. They get into the business and they are overwhelmed by excitement. And that's fair enough. You must be excited. You have just joined the most amazing business concept on the planet. You're part of a multi-billion dollar organization called QuestNet and you're supported by a world-class organization called The V. Now, all of that creates a lot of excitement. Fair enough. Excitement alone is not going to get you there. Now, in our industry, if you ask somebody, why did you join the business? Why did you come into QuestNet? The answer is pretty much standard. I have big dreams, I want to achieve them, or I want this thing called financial freedom. All right? Difficult to put into a box, but financial freedom means you want to achieve a stage in your life where you don't worry about money anymore. That's it. You have reached a point where you spend, you travel, you buy without thinking, compared to where you are right now. Right? Whichever country you are sitting at home watching this on your sofa, I bet you that you think many times before you spend. Now, financial freedom welcomes you to a world where you don't think before you spend. You have that freedom of choice. Now, if you understand the journey of a networker, 
which I'll walk over to the board to explain to you, all right? The marker pen and the whiteboard becomes your best friend when you get involved in our business, all right? The question a lot of people ask me is, Patman, I started here. Sign up. And I'm going here to basically financial freedom. Now, this journey is not clear. Anywhere in the world, any organization you belong to, you start the journey here, and along the way you want to go there, and a lot of people take different routes to get to their destination. You may end up doing this to get there, all right? And some people even take the longest route ever known in network marketing, which is going everywhere and finally reaching financial freedom. Now the question I want to ask you is, if you want to get from sign up to financial freedom, which is the shortest way? Logically, is this. Straight. Instead of going to every corner of town and achieving it. Now going straight, if you have no experience in this industry, if you don't know what this industry is about, and you're a first time networker, very excited, full of passion, big dreams, somebody needs to tell you how to go on a straight line. Or you end up doing what everyone does and go like that. Now the question is, what is this journey? Three years, five years, seven years, nine years, 15 years, or you're interested in getting from sign up to financial freedom in two, three, four years. Now the bottom line is, this blue line represents a system. Now this word must be, you know, carved into your mind. System. Now if you are sitting there and you are an IT person, you have an accountant, engineer, right? you understand the word system. But I'm not talking about a system like that. I'm not talking about an a, a internet system or intranet system. I'm talking about a bottom line is things to do which doesn't require you to think. Now, I was thinking a lot what to name this video. And I may shock you, especially the new people, but the title of this video is Shut Up, Listen and Do. Now, don't get offended. I'm not telling you to shut up in a rude way. I'm telling you a system doesn't work unless you are willing to shut up, listen and do. So the three steps to success in network marketing, if I can comp you know, compress it to three steps, is basically shut up, listen, do. That's exactly what I did. Now when I got into network marketing, I was like you. Signed up, excited, passionate, big dreams, also good looking, all right, additional stuff, okay? But I, I started my journey this way. I didn't have an upline to guide me until I met Dato Vijay Ishwan, all right, our managing partner of the V, the visionary of this company, and I was blessed enough to have him as an upline. And he said, Patman, why are you a moron? Why are you doing this, all right, when you can do this? Bottom line, and I realized that's true. So I said, Dato, what do I need to do? And Dato Vijay told me, Patman, I'll help you, I'll guide you as an upline. And I'm telling you right now, as your upline, all right, I'm willing to guide you and help you, but you must comply with the three requirements. Shut up, listen, and do. Now the problem we face in our industry, and I've seen this all over the planet, is people join our business, our family, I explain to them the requirement of a system, and they go back and they analyze it. They rip it apart, especially those who are overeducated, all right? They want to be professors, and they rip it apart, and they come back tomorrow and tell me how the system is wrong. Now my question to you, if this system has helped take thousands of people to financial freedom, please don't question it, all right? And I'm saying this with a lot of love. Please, shut up, listen, and do. Bottom line, okay? Now a system in network marketing can be highly complicated or highly simple. Now somebody said, Patman, it's easy to use the word system, but what does it mean? Now let's talk about it. Now whatever I tell you in this video is not written in stone. Whatever you hear on this video, watching it right now, go back, pick up the phone, call your upline and tell your upline you watch this good looking Malaysian guy talk about systems to you. Alright? And check with your upline. 
whether the systems I share with you is in line with the systems your upline and your upline organization is applying. I do not want to contradict anything you've already been taught. I just want to add some ideas into your mind, but most importantly, tell you how important it is to belong to a system, to be plugged into a system. Very important. The most important thing in our business, all right, after the dream, of course, is this. Belong to a system, you get a much faster, efficient journey to financial freedom. As simple as that. Now, a system today, all right, can be explained in the easiest way. Now, you sign up, all right? Now, you can look at life like everyone else in monthly concepts, six months once. It, dis it depends how you look at life, all right? I look at life on a daily basis. My mentor, Dr. Vijay, told me, Patman, live today like it's the last day of your life, but plan your life like you want to live for 100 years. And I used that philosophy Dr. taught me and I applied it in my life. Now, when you sign up, what is your journey? Weekly? Monthly? Every six months? Every year? Now, when you sign up, your life goes by 24 hours. That's the bottom line. That means the biggest mistake people make. I sign up somebody. Right? Like for example, when I sign up Shakira. Right? I sign up Shakira. If I leave her alone for more than 24 hours, I have missed out on a crucial point of 24 hours to create the right mindset in Shakira. Okay, if you want to know about me and Shakira, you can go online to the v.net and see photographs of me and Shakira if you don't believe. Right? But the bottom line is, 24 hours, a lot of things can happen. Now this is what happens. The person signs up because you convince them during the presentation, very excited, full of passion, full of excitement. Where does he go? He goes home with nothing, empty hands. He goes home. He talks to his wife, maybe even his mother-in-law, or the neighbor, or somebody, and that person says, oh my God, you're involved in network marketing, it doesn't work, blah, 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 blah. Now that person has basically been brainwashed negatively, and then meets you after one week. What do you think the mindset of that person will be? Low, negative, and you have to work extra hard to bring the person back to the same energy you had him when he signed up. So to me, a system must work for a brand new sign up on the philosophy or concept of 24 hours. So I always tell people, if I sign up with you tomorrow, you're sitting there looking at me, all right? I'm asking you this question. If I sign up with you tomorrow, bottom line, what happens to me in 24 hours? What happens to me in 24 hours? Do you give me a CD? All right? Do you give me a book? Do you give me four pieces of paper? What happens? Do I go back with nothing and allow my, my mind to wander? All right? So I always tell people what happens in 24 hours. Now in my system, when I was networking aggressively in the early days, I always told people that 24 hours makes or break the person. The first 24 hours. Right? What do I give the person? I give the person the eight basic building blocks first i give the person the welcome video all right a welcome video you haven't heard of it call your upline and find out what the welcome video is about it's basically basic information now i don't give the person too much information in the first 24 hours why confuses distracts confuses the person so what i do eight basic building blocks welcome video now, once the person has gone back to watch these two, now will he watch? That's the question mark. Of course he will. Depends how important you made the video. If you walk up to the person and say, Shakira, if you got time, watch it. She's not going to watch it. But if you sit down with Shakira, Shakira, listen, welcome to our business. I'm your upline. I'm responsible for your success in the business. Now, it is crucial, mandatory, life-dependent that you watch this video tonight and I meet you tomorrow. Please watch it. She goes back after two hours. Call, Shakira, are you going to watch the video tonight? Are you sure? Now, this video will never be important unless you make it important. 
I've got this philosophy in life. Nothing is important unless you make it important. So is the eight basic building blocks important? Yes, no? Yes. If it's important to you and you make it important to your brand new sign up. So the question is now this person goes back 24 hours. Now your group or your organization or your upline may have something else. I have no problem with that. As long as that person goes back and in 24 hours gets some basic knowledge to apply in their mind before they see you the next day. Alright, so you understood. So Shakira goes back, watches the video, alright, and then meets me day after tomorrow. The next 24 hours. Now what do I do? Alright, now if she didn't watch a video, what am I going to talk to her in the next 24 hours? I meet her in Starbucks, I sit down, I talk to her, okay, this is no. Let the video educate, give the information flow. You follow through. You reaffirm what is already in the video. Now, can I tell you why these videos are so important produced by VStudios? Because you can only be in one place at one time, you know, right? We haven't established cloning legally around the world. You cannot clone 200 apartments to be in 200 places. So there's only one apartment. How many people can I meet in a day? If I don't sleep 24 hours, 24 people. What happens when you got 2,000 signups a day? How are you going to reach 2,000 people? You need a system supported by this. Can I give away 2,008 basic building blocks? Yes. Can I give out 2,000 welcome videos? Yes. So the bottom line, what I'm saying, let the V help build your network. Let V Studios, all right, put information on a beautiful CD and put it in everyone's living room in the world. So you may be sitting in Brazil, having coffee, and you are reaching a message out to thousands of people, including Japan, China, India, all right, which are upline the V supporting you. So now this video gives Shakira enough information, and I meet her the next day. Now, if you do not know the eight basic building blocks, please call your upline and ask him what the eight basic building blocks is about. It's the most crucial basic training module ever created in network marketing history, brought to you by the V. So now, she has watched eight basic building blocks, Shakira, on the next 24 hours. And I say, Shakira, did you watch that good looking Malaysian guy called Patman on the video? Yes, yes, I think he's good looking, very in, in, uh, informative knowledge or whatever. Then I say, Shakira, I want to talk to you about step number one. I know we just met. I know you may be a bit uncomfortable, but can I ask you a question? Yeah, what's your dream? Because I'm telling you as an upline sitting there at home, you need to know what is that person's dream, either on your left or right or direct. So you'll be able to remind the person whenever he switches off, if he ever switches off. So Shakira tells me, I want to, you know, become financially free, I want to fly around the world, I want to retire and enjoy life. Good. Then I say, Shakira, remember block number two where Mr. Patman talked about commitment? Right? What kind of commitment can you give? I need to know now. Because the biggest mistake we make is we treat everyone the same. No. To me, everyone who signs up gets treated the same until they announce their commitment to me. So let me give you an example. Shakira says, well, I love the concept. I love the products. I want to give it a try. I hope it works. I hope for the best. I wish it works. Commitment. All right. Then I got another guy. All right. Who comes to me and says, Mr. Patman, this is it. I have made a decision. I'm going to do this 100%. I'm going to do whatever it takes. This is my life. I want financial freedom now. You tell me what to do, Mr. Patman. I will shut up, listen, and do. Now, you can just compare the level of commitment of these two people. Now, can I treat them the same? Should not. I'll be a little bit softer on Shakira. I won't push her as aggressively. But the other guy who just basically banged the table and said he wants to do this big time, I'll push. Now the system decides that, all right? So first 24 hours, second 24 hours is your follow through, okay? Now you're saying, Mr. Batman, where can I be everywhere? Hey, I'll talk to you about that later. If you're doing rule number three, which I'll talk about, it's more than enough time for you to meet as many people as you have to. Now after the follow through, the system is divided to two. After the follow through, you already can identify 
how serious this person is. Sign up, first 24 hours, second 24 hours. The second 24 hours, so all of this is happening within 48 hours. Are you guys with me or not? Right, you decide which system is going to follow. Now, the systems are divided to group A and group B. I'll explain this to you. Now, group A, psychotic, aggressive, do or die, already gave you permission to push them, shut up, listen, do, guaranteed. Group B, hmm, I like it, I like the product, I like you, I want to come for the event, I think this will work, I hope I make a little bit of money, you know. Group A, Mr. Padman, we're going to do this, unbelievable. You, know, you understand the difference? Right? Now, you are sitting at home, I don't know which group you belong to. Right? I hope you belong here. These are the people who go express, sign up to financial freedom. These people take a little bit of time, but there is a possibility people from here go here. As they go along in this journey, right? maybe after three months, after six months. But the people who immediately say they want to go to group A, boom. Now here, different system. Here different system are you with me not your head if you are very good okay all right so 20 in 48 hours i can already decide which category my sign up goes in group a group b now the systems of group a and group b are very different now you firstly have to understand that this 48 hours is where most people in the business fail this 48 hours is where you lose people the most. You can't meet them after one week. You can't sign up somebody today and meet them after one month. Now your question is, Mr. Batman, what if I have networks all over town? Doesn't matter. The system applies. This 48 hours is where you lose people the most. You can't meet them after one week. You can't sign up somebody today and meet them after one month. Now your question is, Mr. Batman, what if I have networks all over town? doesn't matter the system applies everywhere you have leadership your group a people will implement systems all over wherever they are so if you are international networker if you are an international networker with downlines in every country every country you will definitely have group b group b is always bigger right but you need group a people in every country without group a people tough to build so where do you identify your group a people first 48 hours or group B people who want to move up to the real networkers, to the aggressive networkers. So if you are sitting and watching this at home today, I hope after this video you make a decision to be part of the group A networkers. All right? I'll explain what is the expectation from group A and what is the expectation from group B. Now, everyone asks me, okay, if you look at our concept of networking, you get a tracking center, you have left, you have right, and you're supposed to get one direct here and one direct here, right? And you are activated, correct? If you don't know this, please talk to your upline. Now, this getting two directs, how long should it take? One week, one month, one year, or 48 hours? Now, please remember, whatever you tell the new sign-up is immediately programmed in his mind. So if I tell a new sign-up, Shakira, you should get your two directs in 30 days. That's good, Shakira. And Shakira will say, okay, she will only do it on the 29th day. Human nature, human behavior. 30 days. If I do it in the first 10 days, too good. If I do it in the second 10 days, too good. Let's wait for the last 10 days. Very moronic. But it's true. Now, what if I told you that activation in my mind, as your upline, should happen in 48 hours? I'm telling you, 48 hours activation, possible. I had 20 signups in 48 hours. I was just, I didn't know. Is it good 20 signups in 48 hours? Great. Unbelievable. You're sitting there and saying, wow, 
all right? But I didn't know whether it was good or bad. No one told me, all right? But today, if I tell you 20 signups in 48 hours, unbelievable, you know we're never going to do it. So let's be fair to each other, all right? I'm telling you, seriously, if you are serious about this business, if you are really serious about financial freedom, activation, 48 hours, very possible, everyone does it, this is normal. If you don't do it in 48 hours, you're already considered weak or slow. You're not serious enough about this business. What is activation? One on the left, one on the right, two directs. Two, shut up, listen, do, see the presentation, buy a high quality, quality product from Questnet, buy this cheap and then watches, QVI, all right, okay, QICOM, you name it. My question to you is, you jumped into this business full of excitement, full of passion. You want financial freedom, okay? I know that. And you are telling me you cannot get two people to join you in 48 hours? Something is wrong somewhere. My mom always told me, and Dr. Vijay always told me, Patman, there's always two people out there who will do whatever you say. My two people were my two brothers, right? And my two best friends or whatever. And my brother, I didn't even show him the plan. I walked up to him, I said, listen, if you don't sign up, I'll beat you up. Right? I went up to my best friend and said, listen, I need you to support me in my business. I didn't even need to show the plan to get activated. So 48 hours activation for group A and also group B. Because remember, the longer the person stays in your system without seeing results, all right, the more demotivated the person comes. The more demotivated the person comes, the more work you have to motivate the person up again, right? So what do most networkers do? They spend hours every week just trying to motivate their people. No, don't give up. You can do it. Unbelievable. Waste of time. You want to talk about, you know, earning checks. You want to talk about the 250 check, the 500 check, the 1,250 check. You understand? That's where your focus must be. How to sustain the network. How to make the network grow bigger. How do we go international? How do we go to the next village? How do we sign up our relatives? How do we sign up your mother-in-law? Do you understand? That's, how, that's what your focus must be. Instead, most networkers around the world, Patman, my downlines are demotivated. Patman, my downlines are slow. Patman, my downlines are switched off. Why? Because they don't belong to a system. They're just floating all around. They're excited about financial freedom, but no one is telling them how to get there. Right? So remember how important the first 48 hours is. Okay? Remember that in the first 48 hours, you must already plug them into group A or plug them into group B. Alright? The first part of the system for me, crucial, is eight basic building blocks. Welcome video. Make it part of your system. If you are part of an organization, then take the eight basic building blocks video and plug it into your organization. Take the welcome video and make it SOP, standard operating procedure for your organization. Then once they have been plugged into group A or group B, you send a very clear message that left, right, activation should happen in 48 hours. Must happen in 48 hours. Possible to happen in 48 hours. Happens all over the world. Depends how serious you are. All right? Now, this word system, don't panic. It's a simple word. It's basically something for people to follow, which doesn't require thinking, which doesn't require, you know, analysis, which just require shut up, listen, do. Right? The more simple the system, the better. Now, our systems around the world vary, but mainly, Systems are covered by events. Right? That events are part of your system. Now you're thinking, I'm in Tajikistan, there's no events happening. I'm not talking about big events. I'm talking about any type of events that your organization has. Right? So like for me, when I started my system, our events were divided to business presentations. Alright? Or BPs. If your group is five people, Maybe your BP starts at home. When it's 500 people, maybe you go to a hotel or hall somewhere. Now, if you launch a system, all right, with events, it must be non-negotiable. What does non-negotiable means? That means your system cannot change every week. This week, business presentation, Wednesday. 
uh, X Y Z O V Hotel. All right. Next week, not Wednesday, guys. We're doing Thursday, not evening, morning. The following week, okay, okay. I think we move it to Monday because Thursday, my cat's birthday. We have to celebrate my cat's birthday. Cannot. System must be written in stone, non-negotiable, and cannot be based on personality. Partner is sick. System cancelled. No. System moves on, regardless of personality. So your question, sitting there watching this video, what you must ask? Hey, partner is talking about a system. Huh? Do I belong to a system? If you don't belong to a system, go to your upline, go higher, go higher, go higher. Sounds like a song. Go higher, go higher, go higher. And you go higher, higher until you find an upline who has a system and you plug yourself into the system. Crucial. Okay? So think about it. Events, business presentation, basic training, monthly rallies or whatever you call it that's your system then you got the v system here the v system is nss revcon vcon all right product training a lot of stuff the v has all right so you got two systems to comply your own personal group system and then plug into the v system now if you're not plugged into the v system your chances of success are very slim. And I'm not saying this because I'm a V partner and the executive director of the V. My success today, my financial freedom, I achieved because of the V. If not for the V, I wouldn't be where I am today. Because their system is the mother system. I'm telling you, if you take any of your IRs or your business partners and take them to a VCon, a VCon, I guarantee they come back switched on. I guarantee when they come back, your checks go up. I guarantee when they come back, their checks go up. Why? Because the V provides that platform. Our system is proven, track record, unbelievable. All right? But our system cannot support you on a daily basis in your house, in your village, Telo Intan, for example, All right? which is my hometown. Okay? So our system is the big system, but you must belong to small systems which plug in eventually to the big system called the V system. All right? Now system also involves tools. Tools are CDs, cassettes. Oh, we don't have cassettes anymore. It's already 2008. All right? Audio CDs, video CDs, books, starter kits, a lot of things. All right? And all of this is provided by the V videos and audio is provided by v studios our website provides information our voyager magazine provide information now you're sitting there thinking voyager magazine website v studios if you haven't heard about it you're hearing it from me so welcome to the v but if you haven't heard about it go to your upline all right or go to the website which is on the screen right now www.the-v.net and you get all the information about the v you want okay so now Tools. Now, you don't have to only use CDs from VStudios. Your uplines may have their own CDs, their own audio CDs, their own starter kits. Use it. Plug into a system. All right? So you got events, tools. Then you got a third aspect of the system, which is a little bit more personalized, which is the relationship with upline and downline. Now, don't worry about the board. It gets more messy as I move on. All right? Upline, downline. So, events, tools, upline, downline. What is this upline, downline relationship? Now, the bottom line, upline, downline, bottom line. The bottom line is you basically have an upline. The role of your upline is to guide you from sign up to financial freedom. Now, you have various types of uplines. You have the military upline who doesn't want to get to know you well but will guide you very efficiently and say, do this, do this, do this, do this, do this, do this. Then you got the emotional upline. I love you, bro. I'm here with you. We are all together on this journey. Hold your hand, sing Kumbaya. You understand? Huh? Then you got the moronic upline who looks at you just as a person who's going to bring signups and he makes money. Now, I don't think there's a perfect upline, except Dato Vijay, to me. All right? There's no perfect upline, but your upline is there to guide you. To tell you where not to go, what not to do, do this, this is important. Your upline has to want to see you go financially free. 
right? And your upline is not always the immediate guy who signed you up. He may be a moron. I always say this and I mean it. Go higher, go higher, go higher, go higher. Find an upline. All right, now once you find an upline, don't stand there and say, excuse me, you have my upline, teach me what to do. It doesn't work that way. You walk up to your upline, you share your commitment with the upline, you share what you want to do, how serious you are. And then tell your upline, please plug me into group A. I want to be your group A. I want to be part of the system. Guide me. All right, now today I'm not going to share with you a proper system because systems have to adjust, adapt, accommodate according to country, culture, public holidays, uh, festive seasons, and also based on the type of people you're dealing with. All right, but I'm just going to do a general overview. Okay, now for the V, we contribute to your system. We don't run your system. We run the mother system, VCON, ReVCON, NSS, but we if you are part of the group A system, right, it's much more aggressive. That means your uplines in group A are going to push you really hard. And this is a sensitive topic, right? Because ultimately, your upline is not your boss. You don't work for him. You're not obligated to him. There's no contractual terms sheet with him. He's basically there. He referred you, right? Can you make it in this business with upline, without upline? No. Somewhere along the line, you need an upline. All right? Can you make it in this business without system? No. You need the system. You need the upline. So basically now, when you are in group A, you belong to a group, an organization. All right? And your upline is there. Now, your upline in group A is a bit more tough on you. Now, I'm a group A upline. When I talk to my group A, it's very different. I'm aggressive. Activation, 48 hours, mandatory. If you don't do it, get lost. Why didn't you do it? It's so easy to do. All right? Group A, they monitor your checks every week. I monitor your check every week. And if your checks drop, why? What happened? If, you're, if you plan to hit a bigger check, how? How do we strategize? Dato was my group A upline. I belong to Dato's group A. And Dato Vijay, every week, I had to go to him like a kid, you know, in school with my homework, my genealogy report and my check. Those days we had printed reports and check. We didn't have this advanced IT system of QuestNet, Quest account. So I went to Dato, put my genealogy report, put my check. Let's say my check was $4,000, right, a week. Dato look at me and say, okay, Batman, what's your check next week? And I'm excited, passionate, right? I said, Dato, next week, 4008 right? Now, a regular upline will say, fantastic. You can do it, unbelievable. I'll support you. But not Dato. Dato said, Patman, how? How are you going to achieve this 4008? Tell me. Show me. Take out your genealogy. Who's on your left? Who's on your right? How are you going to achieve it? How is this guy? That guy? Is this guy fast, slowing down, falling asleep? Right? Is he switched on? Right? Is this guy doing rule number three? Is he on 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 rule number three? On rule number three? Do you understand? So there was continuously questions. Lah. So after listening to Dato speak, right, I go like, oh my God. Okay, Dato, let me re-strategize, let me think. Now, is your upline doing it with you? Does your upline even know what is your check next week? Let's take the question a bit deeper. Do you know what is your check next week? How can you ask? And sorry for being brutally honest, please give me permission. You can always switch off this video, but don't. Keep listening. How can you want financial freedom when you're not even clear what your next week check is? Firstly, you must ask yourself, La, what's my check next week? I want this check next week, that check next week. All right? And then your upline must ask also, what's your check next week? All my direct, my group A hated me when they started networking. They hated me. But today, they appreciate me because they're all financially free. But during this journey, I was tough on them because their group, A, they wanted financial freedom badly and they were willing to sacrifice whatever, all right? And I told them what to do. Now, if you belong to group B, a bit different. Group B is my Shakira, you know? I'm thinking about it, I want to do this, I'm not sure what can I do, what I can't do. Do you, do you understand? All right? And group B, it's a lot of motivation, a lot of love. A lot of kumbaya, 
All right? Like, you can do it. I believe in you. All right? What's your check next week? I don't know. It's okay. Let's think about it. Are you doing rule number three? No, Mr. Parkman, I'm too lazy. It's okay. Next month, try again. But if group A, you don't do rule three, you have a problem with me. Not acceptable. Do rule three or get lost. Get out of my group A. Go to group B. Hold hands and sing Kumbaya. Is group B important? Yes. Very important. Because they are the people from group B who will grow with me in this journey and then they move up to group A. Can you imagine what group A, group B means? Okay? Alright? If this is you, actually the next video I'm going to do is called This is You to explain what does it mean in your tracking center. You have left and right. Let's say you have 500 people here, 500 people here. Now your 500 and 500 are divided. Okay, divided in the sense some are group B, some are group A. What percentage I really don't know. Depends how serious you are. But let's say, you know, you have 50 group A here, 450 group B, you have 75 group A here, alright, 425 group B. Example. Just an example, okay, so you understand. Now this group A people, are switched on 100% committed shut up listen do yes upline what do I do rule 3 done upline what do I do qualify for bigger check done so the mindset of the group A people are switched on so these people the group A basically contribute to your growth of organization consistently you can predict what these people are going to do. Now group B, mix. Some serious, some not serious, some in a hobby business, but they're equally important because they also contribute. But the problem is you can't depend on these people to contribute. But sometimes they're switched off, sometimes they're switched on, sometimes they're excited. They need a lot of push, a lot of waking up. And it's normal in network marketing to have this. Group B will always exist. Now the question is, these people are plugged into your group A system here, right? Let me use another color. Are plugged in into your group A system here, switched on. You are meeting them daily, you are communicating with them daily, you are monitoring their checks weekly, you are strategizing their left and right, you are doing all kinds of things to them. Personal touch, personal communication, personal guidance, personal mentoring. Alright? And then you got these people who belong to group B. Alright? Now group B is supported by a system which is a little bit more general. What does it mean? Events, tools. Alright? Maybe not so much personalized relationship because they are not willing to give the commitment. But you don't lose them. Because from group B, there are a lot of potential people who can graduate to group A. Very crucial. A lot of my group A people came from group B. Maybe six months they were slow. They came to a V event. A lot of my group A people became group A after VCon. After re-VCon. After a V event. Or after listening to a V Studios DVD or audio, they say, oh, something clicked, you know, the click theory, right? And they said, they came back the next day and said, Patman, I want to be in your group A. I'm switched on. I'm committed. I'm willing to do anything. I will shut up, listen, and do. I want financial freedom. And that happens, right? So is this group important? Very important, all right? Now, you can't ignore this group B just because they're not bringing you a lot of sign-ups. This group B needs to be plugged into a general system. That means they have to attend events, they have to get updates. You've got to communicate with them email or direct them to the V website or give them CDs, audio CDs, everything else. All right? Now, in this journey, you also lose a lot of people who totally drop out from networking. Why? Because you did not plug them into the system. You don't know how to guide them, you just let them be. All right? Now, there's a CD I made in Malaysia called the Rambutan Theory. Okay, and if you want it, if you're somewhere else, go online and communicate with V Studios and get it. If where I come from in my hometown, Telo Intan, we have a fruit tree. 
which has a fruit called rambutan. Rambutan is this hairy fruit. You open it, inside is nice white flesh, soft fruit, and you eat it sweet, beautiful, red color, bright red. But the problem is the tree is very difficult to climb, even for experts like me. And what we do was we always take a rock and we throw and hope it hits some fruits and the fruits fall down. Now a lot of people practice this rambutan syndrome in network marketing. Right? They got 5,000 people, they throw rocks everywhere hoping they get some serious people. No, that's the wrong way of doing it. You get hurt by the rock, right? and the fruit is never as sweet as going there and choosing the right ones. So the question is, if you are going through this journey with your group, let the system, sorry, let the system find your best rambutans. Let the system produce the best rambutans. Let the system sustain the good rambutans in group A, right, and the potential rambutans in group B. Now, the question you have to ask yourself is, Padman, how do I get more people from group B to group A? Create more success in group A. Create bigger checks in group A. Create stories of success stories. People who join group A, boom, checks go up in group A and they will have the desire of joining group A. Are you guys with me? Right? Nod your head if you're home, if you agree with me. Right? So here, here's the concept. I wanted to share this concept with you so you understand. So first question I have to ask you is, do you belong to a system? Yes, no. No, go find the system. If the answer is yes, I want to ask you honestly, are you plugged into the system? Are you seriously committed to the system? Oh, it's a system nice to have, nice to see. Oh, I'm part of a system, but you're not part of it. Part of it means doing everything the system says. Remember, right? To be part of a system, three steps. Shut up, listen, do. Crucial. All right? So if you really think about this, signing up to financial freedom earlier, if you rewind the video, was quite simple. Now it's become reasonably complicated. No. 48 hours, plug into group A or plug them into group B, right? Both group A and group B are sustained by a system of events, tools, upline, downline, and V system, right? Now, the most strongest element of the V system, it is implemented by successful people who already did it. And like Dato Vijay always told me, Patman, when you see success, right, don't ask why ask how and follow, all right? So the system the V has implemented works. Now eight basic building blocks is one of it. Empty your cup is one of it, all right? Now, I introduced the past few months a concept called rule three, all right? Rule three is a V system, which I do not know how to make it more serious. I want it to be implemented in every organization out there. You want to know more about Rule 3? Get a DVD. I have a DVD out there called Rule 3. Just shut up, listen and do. Now Rule 3 can be implemented in Group A, Group B. But Group A, if you implement Rule 3, you must implement it religiously, non-negotiable. Do or die kind of mentality. Are you, are you guys with me? Nod your head if you are. So bottom line is, okay, group A lah. In group A, okay, you need to do rule three. Cannot say I'm busy this month. Cannot say, hmm, this month, Mr. Patman, I couldn't complete 15 presentations. I only completed 14. All right, now, let me tell you a story of one of my key leaders. His name is Giri, all right, one of my downlines, group A. And one day he called me. He's a V Council member anyway, all right? Amazing guy, amazing networker today, financially free today. But he called me and said, Patman, it's end of the month, last day of the month, 11 p.m. He tells me his appointment was cancelled. He only did 14. He's asking whether he can do one extra next month. I jumped into my car, drove like a madman, went to his apartment complex, went up the lift, went to his door, started banging the door ferociously. Neighbor comes out. I look at the neighbor and say, go back in. This is about rule three. Now, Giri comes out in his lungi or sarong, what they wear in Malaysia, to sleep. I told him, put on your pants, jump into my car. I drove around my town, 
look for 7-Eleven, which is a 24-hour convenience store, pull Giri in with me, look at the cashier, say, shut up, listen to this guy. He's got to finish Rule 3. Now, the guy thought we were going to rob him, long story, but we managed to complete Rule 3. Now, that's how serious I am if you are in my group A. Because ultimately, as an upline, you have an obligation to help somebody become financially free. You have to give your best to make sure that person become financially free. Now, if that person is a moron, lazy, doesn't want to listen, full cup, arrogant, as long as you did your best, that's good enough. Right? Like my mother always tells me, you can take the horse to water, but you cannot force the horse to drink water, you know? Right? And that's the same philosophy. But my question is, are you dragging the horse to water first place or not? Because the horse cannot see water, right? He's not going to drink it. So my question to you is, how serious are you about this? If you are in my group A, non-negotiable. I will make sure you reach financial freedom, as long as you listen to me. Right? And again, I'm saying this with love, shut up, listen, do. If you are in my group B, I will give you still 100% support through my system. Right? Through VCONs, ReVCONs, NSS. All right? And eventually, if you are dead serious, jump up to group A. Now, this concept of system is not talked enough in our network today. And I want to really focus on this. Because systems can easily be duplicated, can easily be implemented all over the world. All right? If you, even if you're not there. Okay? So ultimately, a network marketing organization, I know I'm going to the corner, can either be a personality or system-based network. A personality-based network or system-based network. Personality-based network means everything is focused on one individual or two individuals. That you are dependent on those people. That without them, your, your organization cannot grow. Not a good thing. Because if both of them drop dead, your network collapses. But the, there is some positive side to it. It's more emotional, there's more talks about loyalty and vision and dreams. Good enough. All right? But a system-based network will last regardless of anything. Everyone in the upline dies, the system should still run. All right? All right? And you can add emotion into a system. Or you can help the V add emotion into the system, add loyalty through the V system. So this is what networking is about. Ultimately, if you allow me to summarize, you sign up and your journey to financial freedom has a lot of aspects. Now if you leave this all in a messed up situation, no one understands it. So there must be clarity, there must be predictability, there must be care, right? There must be strategy. There must be upline, downline relationship, guidance, right? And you, as long as you decide whether you're in group A, group B, group A, push hard. Group B, push not so hard. But you still want them plugged in. So if you look at this example I gave here, you got 50 group A, 75 group A, 450 group B, 425 group B, imagine for one minute, 50 people doing rule 3, 75 people doing rule 3, some people doing rule 3 here, right, just with a small organization of 500 on the left, 500 on the right, you already can be very close to financial freedom. A mistaken belief in networking is, oh, I got 20,000 here, I got 30,000 here, sounds good? Yes, I'm sure you're impressed. My God, I wish I was me here, all right? 20,000. But this doesn't mean anything. My question is, how many people from 20,000 are in Group A? How many people of 30,000 are in Group A? One Group A, all right? Mm. 19,999, Group B. All right, 29,999, Group B. Doesn't help. You need more people Group A. So this guy, you can actually earn more than him in our business. It's not about the quantity of people, it's the quality of people. Do you understand? People who are plugged into the system, people who belong to the system, that's what is important. 
All right? So if you really think about it, this check can be bigger. And this check may be small. It's about system. It's about group A, group B. It's about eight basic building blocks, rule three. It's about events, tools. All right? It's about personalized mentoring by upline, downline. And it's about the V system. Re-VCon, VCon, product training, NSS. If you have not had a V experience, get one as soon as possible. Log on to www.thev.net. It should be here. All right? Okay? And find out where the next V partners coming. All right? The most amazing people in our networking industry, the V partners, the associate V partners. Some of the most amazing success stories, the V council members out there, right? The V leaders, right? These are your uplines. They are trained by the best. They have already succeeded. Their success is already done. And they are here to help implement our system. Now, it's interesting how you look at the board now compared to earlier. <laughs> it's become a very interesting work of art, okay? Now, I want you to understand that ultimately, the V is your upline, the V is here to support you, the V is here to guide you, but the decision is yours. You have to make the decision. All right? The decision is very simple. From the day you sign up until you achieve financial freedom, how do you want your journey to be? Straight, smooth, fast or long-winded, unpredictable, blah, blah, blah. You want it straight and fast and effective and enjoyable and fun, then plug yourself into the system. Find your upline. Plug yourself into your system of your organization. And then plug yourself into the system of the V. Alright? So I hope this whole video helped you understand the importance of belonging to a system. Alright? The importance of eight basic building blocks, please. Simple but highly effective, highly duplicable. Right? The importance of rule three. The importance of knowing where you belong, group A, group B, and the intensity of the system in group A, and the intensity of the system in group B. And how do people from here move to here? Right? And how do you prevent people from dropping out from here? All of that requires this. Na. And the bottom line is, coming back to the day you signed up, why did you sign up? Let me talk to you, all right? So I come closer to the camera, all right? I, I really want you to hear my voice. Why did you sign up? Okay, all right? You made a decision to participate in our business. Whether it's for the product or for your dreams is your call, all right? But you need to remember again why you signed up. Remember that dream, all right? Don't be afraid. Just basically think of why you did this business. And my next question is, how serious are you about this? I have seen thousands of people in our family become financially free. Two years, three years, four years. All right? Okay? But the bottom line is, you have to decide how serious you are. If you're serious, QuestNet, perfect vehicle. The V, the most amazing upline. Plug yourself into the system. All right? And remember the three most important things you have to know. Shut up, listen, and do. All right? Shut up, listen, and do. Plug yourself into the system. And then help me welcome you into the world of financial freedom. So once again, hope to see you at the next VCon, ReVCon, or NSS. All right? And I hope this module helps you. Okay? Understand how powerful our business is. All right, and you just have to plug into the system. And once again, three simple things. Shut up, listen, do. The V.